Let's build and design a section using responsive AI on mobile together. First, we'll add another section and resize it. Then from our shared library, we'll drag that text mask element and resize it and align it with the repeater from the section above it. Let's bring this gray and white drone image in and place it to the left. I'll make it a little bit smaller here. Next, add the Vision Paragraph and Explore button onto the canvas and position them under the text mask. Place them here to the right, then align them both to the left. Once we're happy with the design, let's see how it looks on smaller screens. On mobile, some adjustments are needed. To fix this, once we are on this mobile breakpoint and the section is selected, click on the Responsive AI tool to generate a new layout. Once that's done, our elements are aligned vertically, and if we're happy with this, we can apply the design. But if we want to make some adjustments to better fit what we had in mind, we can make the section bigger and position our elements further apart. Then make this button bigger, drag this text a bit down, and make it narrower. And lastly, make the image a bit bigger. Now this section looks good on every breakpoint. And that's challenge three. Now you're ready to use AI to design more efficiently. Up next in module four, we'll cover how you can add movement to your pages with different position types, animations, and interactions. See you there.